Hey, what is going on guys? T-Dot here and today we are back for the first episode of my MLB 15 The Show franchise. The team we have decided to go with, but as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, is the Toronto Blue Jays. So, um, I did them two years ago, MLB 13 The Show, um, but that was on my old channel. A lot of things have changed with the team since then and uh, it's going to be a totally different franchise. That last one was so unrealistic. I was making trades for Yasiel Puig, uh, Will Myers, like in the division trades and everything. So this is going to be a 100% like realistic uh, series. Um, I plan to go at least like three to four seasons with this. So it's not just a one and done. We try to win the World Series this season. This is going to be a build the team um, series where... Um, we try to build the team in the offseason. We obviously have uh, some pretty good players on the team right now, but we are definitely not one of like the elite teams in the MLB. We have some pretty good hitters, but the pitchers are still young. We don't know what's going to happen with them. Obviously, we're going to have Stroman out for the entire first season, so the rotation is probably going to be Dickey, Burley, Hutchison, and uh, Sanchez, and then we're probably going to either throw in Estrada or Daniel Norris, and then the other one who doesn't make the rotation, we're going to throw in the bullpen. We'll have to make a decision on that. Um, obviously, right now, the official uh, OFSM rosters are not out, but uh, in past years, it's taken about a month for the uh, official rosters to come out, so we're not going to be actually starting the franchise until the rosters come out, but this year, apparently, there has been a uh, thing where you can import the players from last year, so every single year since uh, until this year they've had to create the players over and over again so they would have to create every single prospect in every minor league system uh again and again but this year they can just port them over and then they can just edit their attributes and everything so it's gonna be a lot quicker i expect it to be uh within less than a month uh obviously it'll be a lot quicker uh but once the operation sports roster come out uh, that'll help us make the decisions on who we're going to have in the MLB and everything because we don't know what uh, what overall guy, o overalls guys like Devon, Devin Travis are going to have because if he has a pretty decent uh, overall, then we might want to have him as our starting second baseman instead of a guy like Meisters Turris or Ryan Goins. So there's a lot of decisions that we can't make right now, but the only like certain things we know, obviously we're going to have uh, Reyes at short. Obviously we're going to have Martin behind the plate, Bautista in right, um, Encarnacion at either DH or first base. We're going to have Goins at, uh, I'm sorry, not Goins. Uh, we don't know about the second base position. We're going to have Donaldson at third, obviously. Um, and then we don't know about the center field or uh, left field position. We don't know about second base. We don't know about the rotation. We'll have to see what the rosters uh, come out with and everything. And uh, by that time, the MLB will already have its opening day. We can see the actual opening day rosters for the uh, Blue Jays. So it'll help us... Uh, really pick what players we want to start the, the franchise off with uh right here this is a new thing that they added in this year um sponsorships so we can we actually gain some some uh franchise money to spend uh at every hit and every win now that we got these sponsorships obviously i will be able to get more better ones once i open more packs through diamond dynasty you get them every single pack in Diamond Dynasty, you can get Road to the Show or Franchise things. But uh, you can see here we're going to send Strowman down to A-ball for the whole season. Hopefully it doesn't stunt his growth. Um, and hopefully they actually make the potentials realistic whenever uh, the uh, whenever the OFSM rosters come out. Because right now, like, Sanchez and uh, Strowman are both B potentials and stuff like that. So hopefully they make the, the potential a little bit more realistic whenever the rosters come out. The uh, only other thing that I really needed to talk about this episode, um, I want your guys' opinion. Obviously, we don't know what the bullpen's going to look like. We might have Osuna. We might have uh, Castro in there, depending on what their overalls are in this game once the rosters come out. But uh, the bullpen definitely needs some help, and there is a free agent. Um, I don't know if he's going to be a free agent by the time the rosters come out and we actually start the franchise. But... Um, uh, Rafael Soriano is a guy that the, the Jays have been targeting. We could also go for a guy like Jonathan Papelbon as the closer because that's the bullpen is probably the biggest hole in this team right now. Um, and if we wanted to make a deal, we could throw in Deion Navarro, who has been requesting a trade from the Blue Jays. And uh, the Jays really don't have a need for him because he's a starting catcher. And uh, we already have a starting catcher in Russell Martin. So there are a lot of options we could do with this franchise. Um, and I'm really excited to get it going. But obviously, we have to wait for the actual official rosters. I thought I'd just make this uh, video because I didn't make an announcement video. You guys had no idea what team I'm going to be for this 
this year. So we're going to be the Toronto Blue Jays. This is just us setting the rosters right here. Um, obviously, there are a bunch of things in the, the lineups that we could be interchanging and everything uh, once we get the official rosters. But as of now, uh, the rotation is going to have Daniel Norris in it. But if Daniel Norris's overall doesn't go up, once the actual rosters come out, then we, we, we never know. So we'll, we'll have to see, we'll have to re, uh, re-evaluate once the uh, actual rosters come out. And that's pretty much going to do it for this video, guys. Hopefully you guys are excited as I am for MLB 15 The Show. This is the first video of MLB 15 The Show going up on my channel. We'll have some Road to the Show coming out hopefully today. And uh, I'll see you guys in those videos. So peace.